Hey guys, thank you for tuning in to another video here on the channel. I am here at the corner of Tropicana and Mojave here on the east side of Vegas. And guess what we have right here? A brand new millimeter wave node, which I was not aware of. So let's see here. It's basically got this uh, retirement home right here on lockdown. So if you, you know, fortunately when people dump their loved ones in a, in a retirement home, at least a retirement home can have access to millimeter wave. And of course, what's across the street right there? All those businesses, a Walmart, uh, let's see what else, a big five and all that. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go inside the Walmart after this, we'll go to some of the stores and we'll see if it picks up millimeter wave, but let's speed test it right here. So let's see here. We do Verizon, seven ping. What is that, 1.5 jitter. And as you can see, exceptional performance as usual for millimeter wave. And of course, we're gonna test the other guys too. We gotta give them all a shot. So 39.29 down. And 67.6 .6 on the upload. All right, here we go, AT&T. 27 ping, 0.91 jitter. And this is on LTE with AT&T. Seventy point eight on the down. And seven point two one on the upload. Now let's see T Mobile here and they are connected to their ultra capacity, these nuts. Okay, 13 ping, 5.3 jitter. Oh yeah, T-Mobile's doing all right, it's doing all right. Not bad, not bad. All right, 297 down. and 24.5 on the upload. All right, guys, I'll be right back. All right, guys, we're here across the street in the parking lot. So we're connected to ultra wideband, seven ping, 1.1 jitter. And this is a crate, this is a good, uh, yeah, good test right here. Just to, so we know, here's all the businesses that are right here. So this will help alleviate some of that congestion that Verizon might be experiencing here. So 32, 37 down. And what are we looking at the upload? 36.4. Now let's put this on LTE real quick. So let's say you had an LTE only phone, you were here. Let's see what the difference is between this. Let's see how millimeter wave has helped this area. Okay, 22 ping, 180 jitter. Oh, the LT is still pretty good. But imagine if there was even more people here throughout the day, it would probably be bad. So let's see here. We're looking at 131 down. By 12.1 on the upload. All right, let me pull out the AT&T phone and we'll test AT&T and then we'll test T-Mobile. Yes, I am here in front of a trick Ronald. Guys, please don't eat this garbage. This is so bad for you. So bad for your stomach lining. So bad for your overall health. All right, AT&T LT 43 ping 4.5 jitter. Yeah, guys, this, this stuff is, who knows what they got in it? Who knows if that will give you cancer through time? You know, it's not not good to be eating that type of junk. It's cheaper to eat at home anyways. 94.5 down, you know, get yourself some good food, cook it at the house, you feel me? And also my rocco boy or some shit. And 1.98 on the upload, so 94.5 on 1.98, now let's test. T-Mobile, Ultra Capacity 5G, and then we'll put LTE on here on the T-Mobile line, 
and on the AT&T line we'll test the 5G and see what the fi how the 5G gives it a performance boost. Does it does it leave it the same? Let's see, I already put the AT&T on 5G. So 280 down on T-Mobile Ultra Capacity. And just by going to, just by literally going in the shopping center, we lost half of the performance of the download or the upload. I mean, so 280 up or 280 down, 11 up. All right, let me put this on LTE while we speed test AT&T low band 5G. Okay, we're looking at a 48 ping, 16 jitter. Sixty nine point four on the down. And thirteen point six on the upload. Well, Jose, if you're watching this, bro, yup, la ropa vieja con con gri, you know. Now let's test T-Mobile on the LTE. 28 ping, 0.96 jitter. .6 on the on the down. Oh man, we got the Honda Civics revving. Jesus Christ. And 14 on the upload. All right, guys, let me go to another location and we'll be right back. Hashtag no trick Ronald. All right, guys, we are back. We are here at the corner of Spencer and St. Rose Parkway up here in the borderline of Henderson slash Vegas. What we're going to do is we're going to speed test the carriers right here in this area. Oops, there goes that phone. OK, so first we're going to start off with Verizon ultra wide man. Start off with Verizon 14 ping, 6.4 jitter. And this is a heavy Verizon area right here. Doctors, you know, all that lawyers and stuff live here. So Verizon's heavily used. So 270 down. Here, Verizon used to be like about 5 to 10 Mbps all day long. And then 28.2 on the upload. So 270 by 28.2. What a 14 ping 6.4 jitter. All right, let's go to T-Mobile Ultra Capacity. We're gonna see the ultra capacity on these nuts. All right, 14 ping 3.1 jitter. All right, we are looking at about, let's see here. She's almost done 364 down. And what about the upload? Let's see. 36.5 on the upload. All right, AT&T on low band. 29 ping, 13 jitter. All right, let's put the other phones on LTE. And let's do an LTE test too. Why not? Okay, AT&T, 66.4 on the down, and then 49.1 on the upload. Not looking bad at all. All right, so let's test Verizon on, on uh, LTE. Okay, 29 ping, 56 on the jitter. As you can see the performance on the LTE right there, you know, 5G UW actually helps them out. 66.5 on the down. And 10.8 on the upload. All right, let's test out T-Mobile on the LTE network. Hey, come on, find a server. There you go. 28 ping, 
5.1 jitter. Okay, we are looking at about, let's see here, 73.7 on the down. And damn, look at these uploads. This is not looking good for T-Mobile on LTE. And 2.47 on the upload. All right, now let's test AT&T on LTE, aka 5GE, as they like to call it. 28 ping, 0.69 jitter. Fifty four point two on the down and ATT's upload on LT is actually looking the best. All right, she's almost there. And we're looking at a thirty one point six on the upload on LTE. There are the results, guys. Just wanted to give you guys this, you know, quick little speed testing video in a couple areas here around town. First, you know, we started off over there on the east side. Then we did some shopping center testing. And now we came here to this area to do a little bit more. We're going to be doing file downloading tests coming to the channel. We're going to see how long it takes for files to download. We'll start off probably with test files and then we'll work from there. All right. Thank you guys for tuning into this video. Greatly appreciate y'all. And thank you to all the channel members and everybody who gives small and monetary donations. Thank you for all that. Appreciate y'all. Catch you in the next one. Peace. Thank you for tuning in. Remember to hit the like, share, and subscribe button. Make sure to hit the notification bell so you're always notified when we upload content. Have a great one. Peace.